an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring from Maryville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin Owens. Back. And his opponent from New York City, weighing in at 235 pounds, Shane McMahon! Kevin Owens has a motto of fight anyone. Proof of that came when he challenged SmackDown Commissioner Shane McMahon. Now, it's funny because I recall Kevin Owens having no choice. Shane McMahon had conspired to keep Owens far away from the United States Championship. Questionable officiating and corruption of power on Shane's part forced Kevin Owens to retaliate. And I can't help but get the feeling oh, that this is going to be one of those matches people will be talking about for a long time to come. We touched on Kevin Owens and Shane McMahon's disdain for each other. It became so personal that the only match suitable was a Hell in a Cell. It was almost calculating how KO baited Shane into that position. Michael, I have no doubt that Kevin was expecting, even hoping, that Shane would try something insanely dangerous that night. And when Shane did, Kevin Owens had a guardian angel protecting him as he watched Shane crash from the very top of the cell. Gunbuster. This just ain't gonna do it. Whoa, he works his way out. A bit of a Houdini job right there. Perhaps a power bomb here, Corey. That certainly seems to be the case. You know what I respect the most about Shane McMahon, guys? is that he could very easily sit on the sidelines and reap the benefits of being Mr. McMahon's son. But instead, he chooses to prove his worth each and every time he steps into the ring. Kevin Owens may be in a bad way here. Byron mentioned how Shane proves his worth by stepping into the ring, which is something I don't think a lot of executives would do, let alone go to the extreme that Shane does. Yeah, for some reason, I don't see many executives from publicly traded companies jumping through announce tables. But with Shane, that's really become commonplace. Slam with authority. He's a guy that can turn it on whenever he wants. Irish whip. As we've seen him, he's looked clear the deck. There's a cannonball coming through. He's really looking to prove a point here. You got to be worried about injuries after a splash like that. Kevin Owens setting it up. Pop up power bomb. Here's his chance to win. The no, a kick out. Too soon. I'd have to agree with what Byron's saying. When you've got action taking place all over the arena, complete with every weapon imaginable, it's not easy to keep... Not now. Not now. Oh, no. Oh, it is no time for... This might be it. Oh, my. Not now. Not now. Oh, no. Oh, oh. There's no time for... You know, guys, WWE Hall of Famer Stone Cold Steve Austin has described Kevin Owens as possessing, quote, one hell of an arsenal. KO is certainly a dynamic threat in the ring. Well, Owens moves around the ring with equal parts grace and bad intentions. You'll never see anyone perform such devastating maneuvers with such ease. He's got him covered. Looking to catch him off guard there, I guess. Shane McMahon right on the money with that kick out. Shane's got a lot of fight. We noted the praise Kevin Owens receives for his entering arsenal. However, I find it perplexing as to why Owens approaches most of his matches with a cowardly attitude. <laughs> I find it ironic. This could be all she wrote.
Guys, you never know what you're going to see in a match like this. And if you need proof of that, just go back to watch Daniel Bryan versus Kane from Extreme Rules 2014. Oh, is it enough to end this match? No disqualifications in this one. And that means bad news for someone right now. As Corey mentioned, Daniel Bryan versus Kane from 2014 provided scenes we never thought we'd see. Most notably for me was Bryan. Oh boy, he is rolling. It's going to take more than that to keep his shoulders down. Wow, what's it going to take? He gets it with a reversal. Pump handle, pump handle, into the zone, oh, right across the knee. That should do it. Shane McMahon turns it around. Only one place to go when you're stuck in the fireman's carry. Yeah, down. And I can tell you it's not a pleasant trip. I can't believe everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so physical. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Yeah, he's running hot right now, but we'll see if he can sustain it for long. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Oh, boy, he is rolling. What's he doing? There it is. Did you hear that crack? Owens has him hooked up. Pump handle. Oh, God. Oh, man. Right on the back of the neck. Shane absorbing a lot of punishment here. Kevin Owens setting it up. Will he be victorious? I don't believe it. This one is over. At, you've done something right. No surprise there. That was exactly what we expected when the match was announced for SummerSlam. What an incredible effort all around.